What's going on guys, it's Jacob. Um, today we're gonna to be doing top five scooter life hacks for 2018, which um, it involves just five easy to do steps to make your riding experiences easier, smoother, and better. So yeah, let's get into it with number five, which is make sure you clean your scooter with a toothbrush because it's the easiest and smallest way of getting like, all of the dust and grease and just muck out of your scooter all the time, which I'll give an example right now. So what you guys wanna do when you're doing this is get in like, all your different like little grooves and stuff and just give it a quick wipe out like this. Even just give you the rims and stuff, just a quick spray down like that. And then inside these parts here, as these guys can see, right here is really dirty from my scooter. So we're just gonna get that wiped out of that. And yeah, that's pretty dirty in there. So it's a very good method of cleaning a scooter. So number four is lubricating your wheels and bearing parts with either CRC or WD-40 or something like lubricant, um, which I've got a, over a bit of cardboard on the concrete right here. So what you wanna do is just give it a little spray there and then just one in here as well. And then flip it around, give it another little spray and then just do it on your back wheel as well, same as how I did on the front and you should be good. So um, that just helps with like a smooth ride and it just helps keep it dialed because it's always just nice and smooth and everything. And All right, so number three is probably one you don't see too often, which is hairspray. Use hairspray if you've got a throttle grip or just a slippery grip or anything. So, or if you're putting new grips on, hairspray is really good because it just holds there and it's like nice and strong so it doesn't get throttle grip. Um, what you want to do is you want to get your grips right here and your hairspray and you want to just give it like a nice little spray there if you've got throttle grip and then just like slide it in underneath your grip and then sit it there to dry for like 15 minutes in the sun and yeah it's good so it, I reckon it holds really like sturdy and strong, so don't try like putting soap or anything there because that's just not gonna work. Make sure you get like a hairspray or any other kind of thing like hairspray that sets. All right, so for number two, we're gonna be doing having bolt axles, like these ones here, that you can bolt up because they always have been dialed on my scooter Besides wheels that have just been not, not that good. Um, these river wheels have been really good for me, actually. Um, besides these, I've only run just the normal standard bolts, which are just, just double Allen keys. They're not too good. I've broken heaps of them um, axles, so I've never broken the bolt axles before. These ones have always done me really well, and yeah. So I recommend just having bolt ones. Uh, make it easier as well. You just like leave a little spanner or something in there or like a ratchet or something and you just tighten up as tight as you can and yeah it's good to go all right so for my number one scooter hack it is actually super gluing your cracks in your wheels so i have a crack in my wheel right there um what you want to do is you want to just pour the super glue like where the crack is where my finger is there just inside it and then leave it to set, like don't don't lay it on the ground, just leave it to set and um, it'll probably take about 10 minutes or something and then it's probably good to ride after that and you won't have any other problems after that because it basically just acts as it's like a full wheel, no cracks in it because you filled the cracking with super glue and yeah. So if you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like and subscribe and share for more. So peace.